four compounds of alcohol that are going to be used in this experiment which are N-butanol, 2-butanol, 2-methyl, 2-propanol and alcohol X Next, measure 1 ml of N-butanol, 2-butanol, 2-methyl, 2-propanol and alcohol X and put into each test tube respectively Then add 2 ml of glucose reagent into each test tube respectively, shake them and let the mixtures stand for a while. Observe carefully for any changes taking place. Record the time required for the reactions to occur. And butanol, no changes even after more than 15 minutes because it is a primary alcohol. 2 butanol and alcohol X, cloudy solution form within 5 minutes because both of the alcohol compounds are secondary alcohol the last one 2 methyl 2 propanol cloudy solution form immediately because it is a tertiary alcohol dispense 5 ml of sodium dichromate into each test tube Then add one drop of concentrated H2SO4 into each test tube. Put one ml of each alcohol into the test tube respectively. Put each test tube in the water bath with a precise of 80 Celsius for about 10 minutes. Observe the color of the solution after 10 minutes. Oxidation of alcohol will only show positive results for primary and secondary alcohol and negative result for tertiary alcohol and butanol, 2 butanol and alcohol X color of solution change from orange to green but 2 methyl, 2 propanol no color changes orange color of the solution remain because it is a tertiary alcohol dispense 2 ml of ethanol into a test tube Then add 1 ml of anhydride glacial acetic acid into the test tube. Next, put 3 drops of concentrated H2SO4 into the test tube and make sure the mixture is homogeneous. Warm it in a water bath 
with the presets of 60 celsius for about one minute add 3 ml of distilled water and note the smell of the vapor release The esterification of alcohol will produce sweety, fruity smell.